to you my trip from the fashion culture so today I'm coming to you dolls with a what's in my bag last year for my birthday I got the YSL Saint Laurent sac du jour and I showed you guys that in my birthday haul but I never showed you guys like what's in the bag and I never gave you a review I'm not gonna do the review in this video because then I think it'll just be too long however if you do want to see a separate review in this bag just let me know in the comments below also guys if my voice sounds weird and I'm like sniffling I'm so sorry but I have really really bad allergies and it's the first few days of spring so I'm going crazy right now my eyes are watering like this whole makeup look is ruined because of allergies but anyway without further ado let's jump into the video so this is my baby so this is the Saint Laurent sac du jour I have the black uh, calfskin leather with gold hardware so I'll just do like a little 360 and she does have scratches and scuffs and she's not perfect. I did buy her pre-loved um, but she is still in really really good shape and I love her. I try to wear her as much as I can but I do go to school so um, it can fit my notebook and my agenda but I usually wear my never full to school and then to work I just started wearing this back to work because we have bigger lockers now. So yeah let's just dive right in. So this is what it looks like. Let's see if we can get is what it looks like Ugh, I hate doing this to my bag because it kind of don't do this to your bag guys but I just want you guys to see um so it kind of has like two compartments and then in the middle it has like a zipper pouch if you will um depending on what year you got your bag this pouch can be removable however mine isn't so the first thing I have in here is my wallet this is the Louis Vuitton I think Emily I got this for my birthday two years ago for my 18th birthday with my never full if you guys want to see that video I'll link that down below and I don't carry this in my pocketbook all the time usually I only carry it like when I have cash on me or I know I'm going somewhere that I'll need to put cash in my bag um, so yeah it's pretty empty like literally the only thing in it right now is cash so yeah this is my wallet the reason I only carry cash in that wallet is because I usually use this. This is the Louis Vuitton like pochette. Um, it is the Bernie, I think, print. So I got this in LA when I went and I showed you guys that in the haul. If you want to see that, I'll also link that down below. <clears throat> Sorry guys, see, do you hear it coming out? So in here I keep all my cards, anything I need, like my school ID, my license, um, the skin card I need to get into my apartment. Um, debit cards credit cards everything is in here and I'll just show you like a few things I have a few like single rides for the metro card this is my excess card to get in my building I do have a fake ID I'm not 21 but who cares um, I have my real ID and then I have like a credit card um, a VIB Rouge and you know just some other like things I need and then attached to it I have my car keys and I have this keychain from Louis Vuitton, which I just, I don't know, I got this. I don't think I did a video on this, but I got this one day, like, just shopping at King of Prussia Mall. Um, yeah. Okay, so moving on, um, I have lotion. This is Sweet Pea, not my favorite, but I found it in my car one day. And my hands are always dry. I have super dry skin, and this is an essential just to have. Um, I have more lotion. This is the Jergens Ultra Healing. This one is really, really good because it's for extra dry skin. Um, literally, like it says, extra dry skin. And I'm just throwing the things on my bed as I take them out. This is an EOS lip balm. I don't know. So I'm not really like a huge fan of them, but I like to have several different things in my bag to moisturize or use on my lips. Staying in the lip category, I also have the Vaseline Lip Therapy, the little small one. This is the rosy one. I really do like this. So, um, this is just something you put on your lips. It does give it like a little bit of a pink tint and it's very moisturizing. I also have a few pens and pencils. Like I said, sometimes I do wear this back to school because it can fit my notebook and agenda. So I just like to keep a pen and a pencil in here just in case I do take my back to school. Um, I also have a... Victoria's Secret lip gloss. This is, I don't know what flavor it's in because it's so old, but I really, really like this. This is like one of my favorite lip glosses ever. Um, I have a perfume for Zara from Zara. This is the Oriental perfume and it smells so good. I'm looking for an inexpensive perfume. I highly, 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 highly recommend this one. It smells so good. Or just Zara in general. Um, I think this was like $10 and then the size above this was like $15. So I got this one just to carry in my bag. 
and the bag also does have side pockets right here I don't keep anything in those um, just because I don't so in the zipper compartment um, I keep any makeup product so I usually don't carry a makeup bag but the only thing I do carry is this MAC Studio Fix Powder because it saves my life this is what it looks like and then I carry my favorite brush which is the Morphe M438 so I need to always like uh, touch up my makeup throughout the day and these two save me Moving on, I have a lipstick, so I usually carry whatever lip I'm using at the time. This is MAC Whirl. I wore it last night to a birthday dinner. And then I just have a, um, a mint from Ruth Chris. So I'm getting down to the last few bits of my bag. As you can see, this video is not long at all. I don't really carry that that much in my bag, but I just wanted to get this video out for you guys because it was requested. So this is um, my glasses. I have a pair of Burberry glasses. I am the worst with glasses. This is my fourth pair of glasses in probably the last two years. I just got these a few weeks ago, but I'll try them on real quick for you guys. They're dirty, but <laughs> so yeah. Um, try to keep them in a case. Those are those. Um, I also have sunglasses, and I should have these in their case, but they're not. These are my Celine glasses. You guys have seen these plenty of times. Um, and they're super dirty right now, but these are my babies. I don't really wear my Dior's that much, but um, sometimes they are in here. Moving along, I have Orbit gum. This is the Sweet Mint, one of my favorite gums. Um, I have my headphones. Usually I have my phone charger in here, but it's plugged into the wall right now. I have my phone, which is cracked because my grandma dropped my phone the other day. She dropped my phone, you guys. She dropped my phone. Look at this. I was doing, I literally had this phone for over a year and I've never cracked it. And I just have a whole bunch of loose change, but that's pretty much it. Um, this bag does come with a removable strap and you can make this bag wider or more condensed if you would like by just snapping these. And here's a better look at the bag. guys that's pretty much it if you do want a review on this bag please let me know in the comments um i'm so glad that i finally got this video up for you guys and i'm thinking about getting another bag soon um for my 18th birthday i got my never full for my 19th birthday i got this bag and today's the 22nd of march so in a few weeks i'll turn 20 and i'm really really thinking about getting a chanel bag you guys i don't know we'll see Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any video requests, please leave them down below. As always, comment, rate, subscribe. Bye dolls, stay fat. <laughs>